14. Well, let me get everybody up to speed here as quickly as possible. We entered into a war here, Sweden, and we have taken, we have taken lands, yes. So, so far it's, it's gone well. However, they did retaliate in this specific area. So, we pushed on back with a very big push. Oh, they just sent us a message now as well. So, we've sent through a very big push. We're going to take them out completely. It's, there's nothing else we can do. Um, well, first of all, it's probably fair if if I were to say um, we are beating him or her, their country is falling. But we've got a lot of front reports happening and there's some things that we'll have to attend to. So maybe let's quickly see what they've said in their message and um, yeah maybe it's surrender maybe we can keep them up to <laughs> some sort of i don't know uh, pay me i'll pay you if you stay alive whatever but let's see Well, don't see that particular message right now, but um, yeah, we've got a few things to fix very quickly here. First of all, we're going to take this army here. And we're going to split off four guys to go and fight. And they will go and fight to take this piece of land here for us. Hopefully, they are left with like three. <laughs> Let's see if they catch them. Hopefully, they are left with like three of them. And then they can uh, also defend the land down there again. All right, that guy over there, he's going to stay there. Um, up here, this guy is moving down. He's going to take out that. I'm feeling, let's add a target to him. We'll go there. And then perhaps once he is finished, this entire unit will go there and take out Stockholm for us once and for all. Finish it off. All right. Now we need to do a little bit of scouting all the way from the top of our lands here and see if anything has changed. One thing I can tell you has changed is it seems like over here, there must have been some sort of upgrade to his fortress. So we can't see how many units he's storing in there. So up here we still have 18 plus uh, another 12 there. That gives us 30 plus an armored vehicle. I think it's enough to keep us going against them there, should anything arise. Okay, downwards. I think we should start sending some reinforcements to the guys at the top here. Okay. This guy and his entire unit is also going to 
help us. Um, just want to see where the roots are going here. He can move all the way up there. It's going to take him a while though. I hope he enjoys the scenery and the walk as he goes. All right, now down here, we've got a lot of troops. I'm going to split this this group. Go for Max. Take out three of them. Move them down to here. This unit here, he's a singular. He's going to move down there. This one is going to go and move down there. And then also, we're going to split one more off here. Put him over there. Okay. Maybe we'll give him one armored vehicle as well to go along with it. So as we split them up, we'll take one of these armored vehicles. Just to give us some sort of protection for what's coming. Okay. Then we'll have two armored vehicles. They should survive these two first attacks. And then by the time we hit Stockholm, we should have at least one more left. All right. Down here. What have we said? Okay, this guy, he is moving. This guy, we're going to split him. No, we're not going to split him. We'll leave him right there. Well, you know what? You know what? Yes, we will split him. Seeing as that... Reinforcements are on their way. These seven guys, they're coming down here. So this guy, he can move down here. All right. I think I'm feeling confident that we are, are rather safe from the coast at this stage. So I'm going to move in all my troops here and give myself at least a buffer when it comes to our capital. There's one more guy up here. I'll take him. All right, liking this. Yes, indeed, sir. Yes, indeed. All right, so I'm starting to feel confident about what we're doing here at the top. These units are packed up around 20 each, but it also shows me he's not, it, it doesn't seem like he is very active. So perhaps Helling Ford's and Finland will be our next target. Depending, maybe we can go for something small like Valmeria first, see how things go there, and then maybe we go up and we take on Finland. Yes, most of our troops will be over in the south. Unless we decide to go over take Finland um, straight on Hellingford and yeah, crush them at the capital, then moving our way through up there. But yeah, for that, 
we'll have to stick around and see what the situation on the ground is going to be like. Quickly, we have to check our economics. Just make sure that we're going to make it for the next few hours. Now, right now, it seems like we are making grain. Can I make this possibly a zero? That would be fine. Okay, on material, I think we've got 100%, yes, 100% met. Down there at the bottom as well, 100% met. I would like to have maybe some more iron made. We'll go for something like that. That should, oops, it's a little bit too much. But if I can push my iron to go up just a little bit more, or still, that's going to be hugely beneficial in our next moves. Let's have it at something like that. I've got a lot of lumber right now. Energy. Energy is some sort of problem right now. Um, we are producing gas. Let's see if the markets say... What is cheapest? Now for us to run on coal, it's going to cost us an average of five. And gas, it's seven. So for me, it's a, a little bit of a no-brainer right there. That's what it's going to cost us. So Resources-wise, I think I'm going to change this over completely to gas. Ach, uh, to coal that will leave us at 500 an hour mm. um, with a thousand if we keep it around a hundred that should be about 10 hours of gas so now let's see if we wanted to have about the same amount Let's go and just buy coal, as, as much coal as we can possibly get our hands on. Okay, and I think I am going to go with producing gas. We are going to have to sell more gas to make coal, but we're going to be able to make at least every three bottles of gas um, about six stacks of that coal all right so that's it for our energy okay I'm feeling confident that we should be able to last the next few rounds Stockholm, I don't know what they are trying to do there, but we'll keep an eye. Everybody else should be going to the garrison points, making sure just before we leave that yes. All right. Thank you everybody for tuning in. This one was a little bit longer, but we had a lot to cover. As we're starting to cover ground, we'll meet new enemies and hopefully make new friends. Come around next time. This is Trizus Max signing out and saying, please subscribe. We'll see you around. Bye-bye.